Hey guys, what's going on, man? I'm here to talk about all the big fights that's coming up on HBO pay-per-view. I am buying this fight this um, Saturday against uh, Victor Ortiz versus uh, Floyd Mayweather. Um, I like that fight. I like the undercard. I like everything about that fight. Um, Floyd is giving a young fighter a chance. That's the reason why I'm buying the fight. Um, I mean, I done bought, you know, Floyd. I mean, I done bought so many Floyd fights that he owed me some money. So, uh, <laughs> But uh, I will be ordering the fight. I will be, you know, probably just living it up um, with the drinks, the hot wings. You know what I'm saying? Hey, y'all want to holler? Y'all want? Y'all want to be invited? Come, come holler at me. It's, it was good. You know what I mean? Um, I am buying that fight. Uh, the second fight that's on HBO pay per view is uh, um, um, Bernard Hawkins versus Chet Dawson. I wasn't going to buy that fight, but I thought about it. I was like, man, Bernard Hawkins is fighting exciting fights this. I mean, this time. I mean, I, I like Bernard Hawkins. Don't get me wrong, I like Bernard Hawkins. But some of his fights back in the day to me wasn't, you know, like excitement, excitement. You know what I mean? It, um, some of his fights wasn't that excitement. But you know, I always, I always liked his type of, you know, I always like, I always like him as a fighter because he was one of those fighters that you know. That will show you the skills. And I mean, he's he's showing he's showing these young fighters as today, you know, that he still got it. He ain't you know back in. He even got hurt by John Pascal. John Pascal could have took Bernard Hawkins out. You know what I'm saying? Um, I just think John Pascal had a stamina problem. Um, but Bernard Hawkins, man, is hell of a dude, man. So I am bound. I'm in bound that fight against him and Chad Dawson. Um, moving on. Who we got here? We got uh, Miguel Cotto versus Antonio Margarito. Um, shit. I don't know about. I don't know about that fight. I don't know if I may buy the fight. So, I'm still thinking about the fight. But this may seem weird, guys. This may seem weird. But I, I don't know if you know. To tell you the truth, I don't know if you know. I don't really know if Miguel Cotto will win this fight. I, I tell you the truth, guys. I, I, I'm going. I'm going with Antonio Margarito. I hate to say it, man. I'm going with Antonio Margarito. I think the pressure would be too much for Anto I mean, for um, Miguel Cotto. And I'm thinking about buying the fight. I'm thinking about it. I'm not. I'm not positive I may buy the fight, but um, I'm still thinking about it. Uh, moving on, we got um, Manny Pacquiao versus. Um, my my favorite one of my favorite I mean one of my favorite legends you know fighters um Marquez it's a little shocking because I'm not buying this fight and I'm gonna tell you my reason why because the victory off of the victory that Marquez fought and and it was so it was a fake phony knockout you know fake phony knockout and type of shit like that man makes me scrape from boxing. And make you don't want to, you know, buy the next fight that's, you know, that's that's coming up. I'm not saying that I don't like Marquez just because of that fight. I'm saying that I can't really, I can't really just trust that type of fight, man. I can't trust that type of fight. I mean, we all know, we all know that Manny Pacquiao is going to beat the shit out of uh, Marquez. I hate to say it, man. I hate to say it that we all know that. Marquez gonna pick the shit out of uh, Marquez. I mean, Marquez is old now. I mean, you, you you never can't count the old man out, but I mean, you know, it's it's hard to say because many pack many pack have been looking nice lately. So it's hard to say, man, because you never can count an old person out like uh, Marquez. But hey, I give it to um, many pack out by knockout. Um, I'm not buying that fight. I'm just not buying that fight. I'm sorry, guys. Just not buying that fight. Um, I don't know what what else on HBO pay per view that's going to be in the future, but I will, you know, be making videos about that. And um, I want to tell everybody on YouTube, man. Let's all get along, man. Let's all talk boxing. You know what I mean? Let's, you know, keep this shit, you know, active. You know what I'm saying? If it wasn't for, if it wasn't for a lot of channels that I look up to. And really learn a lot of shit from. I wouldn't be keep. I wouldn't be making videos because I was. I was on YouTube before, but I wasn't making no videos. I was just you know, listen to people, you know, 
opinions about fights and stuff like that. So, you know, people on here motivate me to make videos. And sometimes you got people that, you know, that you can debate with and be like, no, nah, man, I don't think that's right. So, you know, let's all get along. Let's all keep it 100. You know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to all the good boxing fans that, you know, keeping the world out at all times. Uh, I holla at you, man.